Welcome back to Plants Home. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can get both the old and the new menu on both iMac and on Windows. So first over, let's go ahead and get started with how you can get the old menu on either Mac or on Windows. So all you have to do is to get that is to just use Roblox normally on roblox.com. So you just go over to roblox.com, choose a game to play, and when you go ahead and join that game, then you will have the old menu. And this works on both uh, like Windows and on Mac. So now let's go ahead and move on to how you can actually get the new menu if you think that that is better. And uh, this one is a little bit more tricky, but it does still work. So if you want to get the new menu on Windows, either you need to get one of these pop-ups like here, as you can see, it will say try Roblox on the Windows app beta. And then you can just go ahead and click on check it out. And then you will get like a Roblox version, which is kind of like mobile, but has been imported into Windows. And when you go ahead and click on this, it will open like a new tab for you. So when you go ahead and open it, then you will see like this. And when you go ahead and join a game, let me just go ahead and do that real quick. So as you can see, I joined the game. And when I go over to click on escape, as you can see, I have the new menu. And uh, this is going to work on both Windows and Mac too. But if you don't have that pop up, then there is still a way to do this on Windows. I'm pretty sure that link does not work on a Mac. So if you don't get that pop up on Mac, then you uh, aren't going to be able to get the new menu. You can try the link anyway and tell me if it does work on Mac too. So I have left a like code for you to go ahead and copy in the description. You just go over to the description and there will be like this text that you can go ahead and copy. It's going to be the top link in the description. And uh, what you go ahead and do is you just go over to your browser and paste that in and click on enter. And when you go ahead and do that, then it's basically just the same thing as click on uh, as clicking on check it out and you will just get the new like beta app. And then it's obviously just the same thing. It will come up with this and you can go ahead and click on any game and enjoy the new Roblox menu. And anytime in the future, if you don't think that this is worth it or you just don't like this uh, app, then what you can do is you can go ahead and click on these settings. And from there, you go over to click on the main settings page. And here you will see this pop up. So it says desktop app beta. Should you like to leave the uh, beta and return to the previous web experience, you can do so here. And you just go ahead and click on disable beta and then you won't get this. You will just get the old menu and you won't get like any of this like app thing. Oh, and also, if you do want to know about all the features for the new Roblox menu, then I will leave a link to one of my other videos so they can get all the details about that. So if you do want that, then there is a link to that in the description. Personally, I think it's like, OK, it's just kind of like similar to the like uh, mobile experience they get on Android and iPhone. And I mean, if you don't like this, then you can just go ahead and use the Roblox website. This is only going to come up when you actually want to play a game. And in my opinion, the new menu is better. So I'm probably just going to go ahead and continue using that. So yeah, do let me know in the comments how you're going to do. Are you going to continue using the old menu or, or do you like the new menu better? I don't even know if you should call it the new menu because it's like already like a year old. But whatever, I guess we're just going to go ahead and call it that. So if you do want to stay up to date with all the latest Roblox news, events, leaks, and all these like Roblox new menu stuff, then go ahead and like this video and also go ahead and subscribe to the channel. You can also find my social media links in the description. That's pretty much it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.